Greetings and welcome back to Dungeon Defenders Awakened. I'm Catherine of Sky and I'm so excited to be playing again. God, I love this game so much. I forgot how much I loved it. I haven't played it in so many years. I'm just like, why did I stop? Why did I stop? I don't know why I stopped. It's scary that I stopped. Anyway, um, we're ready to go into the next um, area. Let's just do that. Okay, so we have in our campaign... We're off to Tornado Highlands. This is also another new map I've never seen before. Um, we have different... Uh, I'm wondering if we should push it up. Oh, you have to reach level 60? Dude, please. Um, really? It's not hard enough on a heart yet. <laughs> what level is, it? Is, my, uh, is my little guy on? Let's see. He is level... Level, 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 hello. Level 22 only, and I already want more difficulty. Let's go! Dang it! Okay, fine. It'll be fine. We'll figure it out. Uh, Tornado Highlands, let's go. Never seen this map before. I'm really excited to, to get in here and check it out. See? Okay. Two crystals to defend. Um, bridgy bridgies. They're back to back, which is a good sign, I think. Oh, fun. Okay, so this one has an entrance here. Actually, let's press G so we see the, the runners coming up here. This one looks like it has this door and that door. That actually could be quite well... Uh, defended by having a one of these over here, I think. Yeah. And in other news, we can have a, a barricade here. And I don't know what we'll do down here. Probably a barricade. But it's not going to hold them for very long. I think we need like three barricades. This is quite long needed okay so i remembered what we we're missing from ev um we used to have a wall she used to have a wall um and she used to have plasma defense system that sounds weird okay so wall doesn't exist and buff beam doesn't exist oh god why why I? um all right let's go back to squire squire seems a good starting point for many uh, many. Okay, so here we have that lane and then this one. I don't think that a single cannon is going to cover them both. No, I don't think so. Can we? We could do a... This is 30. Let's just try this. And then we need a... We definitely need the ballista here. Okay. And then up here, this one probably would be probably just here, I guess. And then wall. Maybe that wall will hold with one. Maybe. Maybe. Um, wow, when we have nothing left. So the issue we have is here. Because we have no wall in this area right there. That is not great. All right, well, let's do our best. Let's do our best. Ah, and I forget. Can we change? No, you can't swap heroes. Whoops. Okay. Okay. I don't think we can kill these fast enough. The... Okay. That one is doing work. But it's still not enough, I think. No, we really do need another... Okay. Let's see how Top Crystal is going. Seems to be okay. This looks like it has held quite easily, in fact. Quite easily. Okay. Fantastic. Fantastisk, as I should say. Pardon me. Okay, there was not much here. Okay. 
I wonder if there's any boss coming at the end of this. I don't know. All right, let's get this thing moved or uh, buffed or something. Just want to cover both both points here. And then I want to do a a wall here. Yeah, I'm surprised that the EV has changed so much. I really liked the wall, though the buff beam. I kind of kind of hate, but I kind of like the removal because it was meta. It was the meta. It was just like you had to use it in every single thing you did, which is not really a good strategy, honestly. If you have to use that tower in everything that you do, kind of it's it really restricts builds a lot, and I'm not a fan of that. Let's see this one can be very like hmm. I could do something like that which would maybe I don't know if it would hit that far though okay let's just do all right so there's one here we're starting to get purple items by the way that's pretty exciting really really thrilled about that okay so there's that now this one okay we have that there's three over there now uh, is there anything else that we want? Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Let's change heroes. Apprentice. Um, huh. I'm not sure, actually. One of the things that we can add, maybe, is a few of the um, Inferno traps are quite useful. As it, as it happens, it's pretty good put them like here they're fairly cheap as well what is her weapon like can I fend people off with her weapon no it's very bad okay I was just thinking like if we have a boss phase um, might be good to take her because she can create the uh, death spike traps which are really useful Okay, so this should this should kill everything. We should not even need to run around. Let's see what we got here. Okay. So these um Oh, that's nice. Look at that. Look at those death spikes. That's perfect. Where is the Did I not put a wall out here? <laughs> Apparently I did not. No wall. Okay. Fun. Fun. Put one there and then maybe put an inferno trap up here in case enemies get that far. Kind of doubt they will. Kind of doubt they will. Let's just go pick up the loot. We don't want it to get sold automatically. Oh, there's a bow. That might be useful for our huntress. Okay. And I think I would definitely like to pick up the Huntress right now. Let's go to her. Uh, what number is it? Three? Inferno Trap. Yes. Good, good. What is one number one? Explosive Trap. Okay. No, I like, I like the Inferno. That's the one I want. I want the Inferno Trap. Okay, we have that one there. This one we'll put right here. I want them to step on it right as the... So when you look at these traps, by the way, the the center bit is the activation pad. They have to walk there. But then the um, blue AoE is where it actually hurts enemies. So that's pretty important. Let's look and see what we can do. If she can get a better weapon. Fortify... Defense armor repair. Hmm, do I have anything in that? Power. I really don't want to trade power. Oh, that that is ended up being terrible. Okay. Range is good. Where was that other thing where we had power versus fortify? Was it the gloves? Might have been the gloves. Fortify. I kind of want power more than than fortify. 
This is range. I think I'm going to take the power gloves instead. Oh, these are nine power. That's good. These are the fortify. I don't want fortify right now uh, on her. Okay, so the other, the, the, the trap that I am uh, was thinking about is this thunder spike trap, which is massive. Massive. Maybe I can do a, what I could do is one here and then one here. And I can kite. If there is a boss, I can kite them to these locations. Uh, and I think that would work quite nicely. So let's just upgrade these guys here. At the moment... Oh, well, we're done, I guess. J8. Because these guys do an immense amount of damage. Look at this. 56,000 lightning damage. It's nuts. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Kobolds. Trap. Okay, I need to repair this trap. Also, I think the traps, I'm wondering if they are used via activation, as in they only have so many activations and that's their, their repair number. I'm not actually sure. I've kind of forgotten. I think after playing for a little bit, the graphical style is kind of growing on me. I'm not quite as annoyed as I was earlier about it. So. Well, annoyed is a strong word. I wasn't annoyed. I was just like, okay. This isn't quite what I was expecting. But it's so funny how, like, a lot of the sound effects are the same, and it gives you that same really cozy vibe um, of playing this game. Ah, oh, yeah, it looks like we need to keep on repairing these traps. Actually, what we should do is we should upgrade them. Because they'll get more activations when you upgrade them. And I'm very consciously putting those lightning traps, the boss traps, out of range of most of the other uh, enemies. I believe they only hit one enemy, so uh, it doesn't really make a difference anyway for like a mass of enemies. Okay, not enough mana. Yeah, that is actually that that's where you need fortify on the huntress. Maybe I should take that fortify uh, gloves because they'll get more activations. I forgot if uh, if you don't have enough activations, if it disappears um, or and you have to like rebuy the whole thing or if it just, I don't know, goes to zero and then you have to do the thing. I don't remember. Alright, uh, let's get the Huntress out again. And I... This is Fortify. That's nice. Power versus Fortify. No. Gloves. These are... Rate. Ooh, sexy rate gloves. You know what? Let's do sexy rate gloves. Let's do those. Seems good. I kind of feel like I should get out the apprentice or somebody else with a uh, boomstick instead of being a, a melee character right now. Go ahead and upgrade these.
so much loot. Oh my god. That's a lot of loot. Does it tell us how many maximum activations we have? No. Not at the moment. So where are the rest of the enemies? Ah, okay, it looks okay now. Sometimes in the in the old game it used to get stuck if there was like a single enemy, like I don't know, like an archer or something hanging on and the the uh you know the other traps couldn't hit it or whatever. So um yeah, now it's seems to be going in the right direction. Now it does look like like when you start the game, you can see on the doors the number of like enemies that are coming. Oh, I forgot to put a uh, um Oh, yeah, the slow traps again. Meant to put slow traps. Dang it. That's annoying. Um, ensnare auras, specifically. Wow, stuff's getting killed all the way back here! It's fun, like, as you're playing these maps, you're learning how to get around and all that kind of thing. Okay, so last round, I like that that sort of minor chord that they play there, that or that minor theme. It's not just a chord, of course. Um, let's see. Let's grab our monk, and also let's grab any kind of good fortify is good, but we don't really need it right now. Overdrive, sure. Um, Infinity Blade. It is better. Objectively better, though it's still crap. <laughs> it's still crap! Uh, power is good. Um, this has Fortify and Range? Wow. Sure. I'll take that. What do we got here? More Fortify. No, I'm not gonna take the, just the Fortify on his stuff right now. Wait, this has- oh wait. Ancient Authority. I wonder if you have to have all four pieces to get that range or rate. Or... It's hard to tell. Miner's Moxie, Primitive Power, Guardian's Grace. I wonder if that's in trying to encourage us to get like different armor sets. I think it probably is. Let's see. We can Maybe we can check real quick. Let's see. This one has, let's do this one, power, 10, uh, 10, 22, so 30, 30 plus, so 52, 52, 52 plus uh, 18, that's 70, power 70, oh my gosh, wow, so we don't, we don't have to have all those four pieces. So this one will give us fortify and rate. Let's do that. Holy fuzzy cats. Okay, let's give you those stats. And then I wanna, we gotta do something about those kobolds. I'm do, I am feeling like ensnare auras are definitely the new buff beams because of all of the kobolds and stuff. Uh, they are quite effective at slowing them down. Let's see, let's slow them here. And then we'll go down here. The, uh, this new idea of like, um, I don't know, the double, the double, uh, the double jump is quite floaty. All right, let's see if that will give us some good distance so that we can slow down those kobolds enough to to hit us here um and what else do we want maybe we put in some electric auras as well 
Wouldn't mind doing that. Won't we be able to do too many? Just put one... Wait, what? Oh, we don't have one here? Oh no. Sad times. Alright, four left. What do we got? We can do another ensnare. Where, though? Where do we put the ensnare? No. Healing, strength drain. I don't know. I guess we can put a... I don't know, strength drain here if, if we have a boss. All right, so let's go back and go. I don't know if we're going to have a boss or not. Um, we do have the spike traps enabled. Let me go ahead and... Did we upgrade them? I don't remember if we did or not. 65? Nope. 78,000 lightning damage. That's a lot. That's a lot, a lot. Oh, and we have no more crystals. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Dudes, 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 dudes. <gasps> no! Oh, I died. Whoops. It's okay. I recommend not dying. Looks like everybody is clumping up in the ensnare auras, which I guess is expected, of course. But I didn't feel like it would be this dramatic. <laughs> oh well, I'm just grabbing loot. It's fine. Let's see. Let's um, repair these uh, auras. Or not auras, but the traps. Oh my, we do have a problem here. Slight, slight problem. It is fine though. Let's repair these guys. So it did make a ruin of those for sure. Okay. Uh, okay, upgrade this. By that, by upgrading, you also remove the need to repair. So you're kind of getting more bang for your buck. Okay, everything here is fine. All right, now less, just half the enemies to go. Let's see what else we can find here. Ooh, an assassin, look at that, fun. These guys are dangerous. They can jump a lot. All right, cool. Those assassin guys are really scary. <laughs> they just like, oh, still kobolds getting through here. Maybe just too many enemies to target here. Uh, the these. Auras, the slowing auras, the ensnares, really work well when you have electric, uh, so that the electric can kill them while they're getting ensnared. I probably could have done that instead of having the extra um, harpoon there. Are we done? Oh, already. Oh my goodness. And here I thought we were going to have something dangerous come out. Dang. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, cool. Let's finish up then. 158,000 XP. That's pretty good. Seems good. Ooh, Ramparts. Oh, this was a good map. I remember this from back in the day. Uh, I guess we can just go there directly. We don't need to go to the tavern in between. With their journey to the Tornado Valley complete, our intrepid heroes enthusiastically brave the terrifying rifts transit to their next destination. <laughs> Yeah, that is for sure. Very familiar territory. I know this map very well. God, I've played so much of this map. Those are new bushes, though. 
Hadn't seen them bushes before. They's new. Uh, it looks kind of weirdly decorated. Like the, I think the vines are new as well. So this is a cool map. This is a kind of a funky one. So there's a door over there and these enemies come right up here. And then, um, those can of course come up here as well. But the other door, uh, is over here. There's one here and one over there. And then this is kind of fun. It used to be, yeah, can you use this? Yeah, look at that. You can shoot stuff with these uh, thingy thingies. Ah, yes, and of course there's a door down there as well, right over there. So, uh, we used to have very specific ways of dealing with this thing. Also, you'd get wyverns coming up and over the roof here. So that's going to be kind of important as well, I think. Uh, huh, how do we want to do this? I think we just put in very, oh, build phase. Yeah, let's go with build phase. Yes. I think we put in a couple of these guys in here. These are a really nice kind of uh, uh, AOE arc, which is super cool. All right. So we used to put like an EV wall across instead of having uh, other walls here. Let's go ahead and just put down... Uh, maybe we get the apprentice walls for this. I don't know. Anyway, so that's for there. Um, of course, these guys can also come down this way. So we might want to have like a, another one here. Actually, this one would also be really good for killing wyverns from that direction. Oh, we are already having wyverns from that direction. Okay. Um, okay. So this one, does it go that way? It does. Okay. I think they can get them from that direction as well. All right. Um, we have 110 left. Ha! <laughs> That's not a lot. Oh God. No. Help. Help. Might have to kill the wyverns myself. Actually, they shouldn't be coming from here. They should just be coming from this way. Uh, we need to set one up here. Okay, and then we need to set up one for the wyverns. Urgh. I guess what we'll have to do is just take off one of these for now. And just put one... That's coming from that way. Okay, so let's go on the roof and put one up here. I think that's probably the best design here that we could hope for. Or maybe even something like this. Dude, I really wish you could like change how far this is away from you because it feels like it's way too close. Like it's where it's constantly just like under your feet. And I, I don't remember that trouble from uh, the original Dungeon Defenders. It feels like it's way too close to you where you're summoning the, uh, the tower. All right. Anyway, let's check our stuff and things. Fortify. Yeah. Let's see. Also, I wish that this C was always on. I don't understand why it's not. It doesn't make any sense to me that it's not. Okay, power and fortify. That looks great. Ability, sure. Boost attack rate, lightning damage. Sure. I'm going to go ahead and update. Actually, no, I'm not going to bother updating all the heroes right now. I'll just do the ones that we're kind of, well, I don't know why I started updating this one. Uh, we have four points. One, two, three, and four. Apply. Okay. I'm going to get out the apprentice for fighting because this is going to be interesting. Um, I think I have everything covered, but it's also hard to tell. I remember that tiny corridor there that used to be really dangerous because you could get some big monsters coming through here and it was really, really scary. Right now we're on this hard difficulty, but honestly, it doesn't feel very hard. <laughs> All right. What's going on over here? Let's see what's going on this way. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. How? Oh, it's one of those ninja dudes. Oh, the ninja dudes killing me. Oh, and, and wyverns from there. Okay. Okay, dude. 
I think the ninjas are not allowed to attack the crystals, as I recall. I think that's a thing. Alright, let's go around and collect stuff. Actually, you know what? Let's get on our uh, squire and because I forgot about this side, this is not great. So what we're going to do is put one here. Yeah, there we go. To, to help those uh, wyverns get killed. Didified. This looks done. Actually, I don't like these holograms floating in the air. They look really weird. I, maybe they're okay. I don't know. I just, they, they don't, we used to have better notifiers. I, used, I th thought they used to look really much better in the re original DD. Um, now they look very odd at best, I would say. Okay. So beyond the first wave, a lot of the times you don't even bother putting up walls. Okay. That kind of isn't a thing. You just end up putting more, um, more of these, uh, more things, more, more, more damage use stuff. More damage is good. More damage is very good. Uh, so here, let's put in this one. And then if you needed to, you could always do like a reflect shield for enemies that are like ranged and stuff like that. Okay. Um, I think we just need, I think we need auras in the next, uh, emanation here. That would be nice. And auras probably in front of like here, like if they get this far, then they need to be aura out. Definitely ensnared and, um, yeah, auras. More to auras. More to auras. Also, I'll go over to that other um, ballista and you can see what it does. Eh, eh, eh. Oh, there's nothing to shoot. I really hate those ninja guys. I believe they can't damage the crystal directly. I think they are kind of there just to kill you, the player. Whoa, okay. Don't make me fall off, dudes. Excellent. All right, pick up stuff. Uh, let's get out, monk. Now, as I recall, I think there's an ogre. Like in the original Dungeon Defenders, there is definitely gonna be an ogre coming out. Let's see, let's see. Aura. Let's put an aura here. And then... No! Not a healing aura. No, 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 no. Is it four? No, two. One, two. Okay, gotta remember these new new keys. Right, we didn't have any issues with wyverns that time, so that's pretty great. I think I'm going to stop picking up like white items. Just let them get sold. Okay, here's one, two. Okay, very good. All right, so now I want to go for Huntress. And I want to put in a couple of these spike traps here, the thunder spike traps, just in case we have enemies going for the crystals. I'll put one here too, maybe. And then I'll put in like an inferno trap over here. Those are quite nice. And then up here as well. Okay, so let's see. Can we give her some stats? Eight stats. One, two, three. Um, let's go with, um, no, you, there we go. Uh, do we want anything for apprentice? Hmm. 
I think having... I think we used to put like a... One of these guys. The Deadly Striker Towers. How is that an invalid location? Yeah. Oh, resources. Okay, so I think that's going to be good. Let's just level uh, the apprentice up a bit. Okay, go. Good. And go. Boom. Sometimes it's easier just to spam E than, like, pick and choose. How's this area going? Seems to be great. Yeah, they're just getting murderized over there. Pretty easy. We'll just take green and above. Oops. Nope. Oh, well, that's an upgrade thingy. Dude. That's not nice. <laughs> that's not nice. Dang it. Thank goodness I'm not on hardcore. This would be a real pain in the socks to deal with on hardcore. It is not... I would not recommend that for anything, man. Okay. Okay, blue. Is that blue? It is blue. Hard to tell it's blue. Like that needs to be darker, I think. All right. Let's go on our rounds, collecting all the stuff and all the things. Well, not all the stuff, but relevant stuff and things. Then I usually like to go down this way. I still remember where all the chests were. <laughs> Purple and blue, blue. Nice. Okay, so are we... Hmm. Let us upgrade some of these. And then... And then one of these. Okay, let's go. Nice, there we go. Best walls or no walls. <laughs> um, if you use the summoner, uh, a lot of times you could put a bunch of archers on a buff beam. Of course, we now no longer have buff beams, but um, they would just stand there and people and the enemies could not pass by them because they were so, th so tight, so thick. So that was a thing that we used to do as well. Nice. Everything working. Wave four of five. Excellent. Purple is always good. Oh, dudes. Aww. Well, hopefully that gave enough time for those dang harpoons to, <laughs> to locate them. Jeez, that was horrible. I hate getting killed by those things. That's bad. So that's a reason not to make a hardcore character is those ninja things. 
I'm like, I was standing, remember when the first one hit me, I was like right in here. So like, you can't really defend against them. You can't. Even if you have all of this wonderful, all of these wonderful traps, they still are going to come get you. They're going to come get you. Well, let's just start our walk around. Since stuff be dying, stuff be dying. Oh, dudes, come on, get killed. Let's go. Uh, last phase. I think we should get some ogres because we've already had some already. Uh, we yeah, we have had some already. We've already had some already. Many already's. Too many already's. Sorry about that. Got purple books, blue things, stuff and things. All the stuff, all the things. I might start stop taking greens now as well. It's hard to see with all the crystals. Yeah, hmm. it's fine. Okay, that would be a nice thing. Like, is there like an auto sell? Let's see, filter bags. Can you general quality all items? Okay, let's just do these. Uh, oh wow, there's many things, aren't there? Accessories, misc, sort newest down. That's perfect. Okay. Uh, locked, unlocked, upgrade range, level range. Okay, so this is hopefully going to show me um, all items. Yeah. Okay, good, good, good. So this is only going to show me non white items. That's pretty great. Defense rate and fortify. Wow, 25 fortify. Holy fuzzy cats. These are pretty, pretty big items. Power and fortify. I should leave some of these like for summoner. Summoner needs stuff, man. Let's see, ability, not. Definitely doesn't need ability. Let's see, range and fortify. Fortify and fortify. Power and range. This is repair. I don't really care that much for repair. It's fast enough, I feel. Like, it doesn't really matter. Fortify and power. Yeah, we'll take that. Much fortify over there. <laughs> power and fortify. Um... Fortify and power. Yep. Beautiful. And EV. EV. I don't know if we need a lot of fortify on EV. Maybe on Huntress. That's right. Ooh. Decent gun. That's always good. Power and power. Hmm. Those are really sexy gloves. Power and power. Yeah, I'll take those on, on that. On that character. Okay, Eevee. Really want. Let's see, Fortify and Power is good. Okay. We don't actually have anything via the EV right now on this map at all. So that's slightly better. More fortifying. Hmm. More fortify. Uh Fortify, I guess, would be best on this guy. Let's see. Who else needs a fortify? Oh, actually, our monk could use a fortify, maybe. I like the vitality on him, though. Ability, eh. Power and fortify. Hmm. Power, fortify, range, and for Range is really good on monk, too. All right, let's skip this. Let's go just back to our... Okay, this is wave five. Um, we have a lot of mana to spend here. Let's just go here and do this. Spend it all. And we're good. <laughs> that was quick. I think, yeah... Gora, sure. All right, nice. Anybody jumping's gonna get it. Is 
There's some wyverns up there. But it looks like they are getting harmed. Oh, oh, oh. There's one there. That has not bit in the dust yet. Okay, I got it. Definitely pays to keep looking for stuff. What's nice about having that filter on the bags is that you can just like pick up everything like a vacuum and not have to look so carefully and just make it go away, basically. And it's only going to show me what I want to see. Okay, dead. <laughs> whoops, whoops. One of those kobolds must have gotten me early. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Boulder tooth. Oh, no, I died it to this guy. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, boy, oh, boy, boy. We need to get over here and kite him. Can you... What? He hit me from that far away? How can this be? Dude. Wow, that's bad. Okay, are there any other big enemies that I need to worry about? No. Well, we don't know what's coming in the next phase anyway, so we might we might have to worry. I don't know. Yeah, much easier just to vacuum instead of, like, kind of, like, analyzing each one. Really, dudes? Come on! <laughs> That's so dumb. All right, let's keep watch for big enemies. Also, let's make sure that these, uh, these guys are not dead. Let's see, R... Okay. Oops, stuff getting awfully close here. These seem okay. Victory! Wow, that was it? No dangerous ogres? Or not too many of them, I guess. All right. Okay. Pick up the stuff and the things. All right. Cool. Well, that was fun. Awesome. Yay! Hoo -hoo, that's fun. I like the way he twirl twirls his thingy up in the air. All right, let's look at our summary. Fantastic. 223,000 XP. Oh, throne room. Oh my god. I know the throne room. Holy fuzzy cats. I've played that so many times. Urgh. That's going to be fun. Next episode fodder. I'm going to uh, do the um, the gear allotment allocation in, in between episodes. So we don't have to watch that. I don't know if you like that or not. If you want me to do it in the episode, just uh, drop me a note and I'll try to accommodate. But anyway, thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other. And I'll see you next time.